Hello guys from Broadband TV, this is Thiago and I have Victor with me. We're going to show you a little demonstration of how our Nutrition Mail API works. This is the register new user. We're going to insert a new user, new user here and we have a successful response from our API. And now I'm going to get a user login. And when we log in this user, our API will generate an API key and response to us. So we will have our newly generated API token here. And this is the token that we have to pass in every call to our API in order to be able to interact with it. Now we're going to interact with USDA API. And let's perform a quick search here. For example, egg. This is a list of items that we get from USDA service. And here we have USDA food ID and USDA food description. This food ID is very important because this is what we will use to get nutritional facts for our recipes. And if we select, for example, this one, we can get a complete report for it by hitting the service request. And we have its description and its nutrients. If you notice, and I will hit again, the search is much faster because we cache these responses from USDA and this makes our API service much faster. This is the food search and food report functionalities. Now let's create a new recipe. Let's put its name. And we can use some new food that we just searched. And we will have 300 grams for it. We do send and we have our newly inserted recipe. Its ID is 28. We can now get a complete list of recipes for this user API key. And we format it and go all the way down. We will see it's here. And this is the item that I just inserted. And now we can finally get this recipe nutrition facts by getting its complete information from it. We have the name and we have total quantity of water, energy, protein, lipids and etc. This is all nutrients from its ingredients. And if we come all the way down, you will have our list of ingredients for this recipe. But let's just open it and remove some unnecessary ingredients. Let's just put this one and I want to change the name to Thiago. And send. We have OK response from our server. And if we get this recipe, We have our new name, our new nutrition facts, and we will see that we only have one item here now, one ingredient. And for last, we can delete this recipe and if we try to get it, we won't have it. Take a Guys, this is all we have.